Okay, the Tesla wind turbine. It's turning. It's uh, probably producing uh, 300, maybe 400 watts of power now. And uh, I have, it cost you 25,000, 30,000 rand for a two kilowatt uh, um, turbine like that. Now for that price, I can buy four panels and a battery. So three and a half kilowatts of battery, four panels would be uh, 1.6 kilowatts. So let's, with the efficiency, you get 1.2 kilowatt power. That's what those panels will produce right now. And charging a battery if it was flat. And for that turbine to produce the rate of two kilowatt, uh, the wind must blow day in, day out. Um, it's not worth it. Um, in South Africa, I must say it's not worth it. We've got too much sun for us to really make a wind turbine efficient um, or worth the, the money. Yes, I'm sure there are certain uh, uh, applications that uh, the wind turbine would be worthwhile. You might not be able to put solar on your roof and uh, in that case you will have to put, you know, 10 of these things up which will cost you a fortune um, to be able to do uh, alternative energy. Um, I would then in that case still think of some other way of uh, you know producing uh, solar and uh, putting uh, it into the batteries. So that's a quick uh, update on the Tesla wind turbine. Yes, it was a good experiment and uh, it uh, is interesting to see this thing turning on your roof. Um, but definitely, um, I don't think it's worth uh, spending that amount of money and uh, for something that is not as efficient as what solar is at the moment. When I say solar, <coughs> I include the, uh, the batteries as well. So solar panels and batteries is definitely more efficient than the uh, wind turbine money uh, value for money.